Welcome back to my channel, Medin Language, and we're going to tackle how to find the measure of kurtosis group data. So, ano ba yung measure of kurtosis na yun? Measure of kurtosis is a measure of the tailness of the probability distribution of a real valued random variable. So, any yung formula na gagamitin natin? The formula na gagamitin natin, we have k is equal to the yung numerator, the summation of the frequency multiplied to the fourth power of the difference between the midpoint minus man ng mean. At ang denominator naman, that will be the number of data in the sample multiplied to the sample standard deviation to the fourth power. Okay, in dealing with this formula, you just have to be careful with the order of operations, okay? Especially, magkaroon kasi dito exponent. So, you now have to know kung ano yung unahin mo. Now, let's talk about the three types of symmetrical curves. So, we have three types. The first one is platycurtic distribution. The second one is the normal distribution, or it's also called mesocurtic distribution. And yung last one is the leptocurtic distribution. Maybe sa test nyo, papa-enumerate sa inyo yung tatlong symmetrical curves ng mesocurtosis. Okay. So, yung alamin natin kasi dito yung value ng k. Pag ang value ng k ay less than 3, so that will be a platycurtic distribution. Pag equal naman siya, that will be mesocurtic distribution or normal normal distribution. Last one, pag ito ay greater than, ang k is greater than 3, that will be leptocurtic distribution. So let's have the first example. Okay. Now, if you will remember in my previous video, so pakita ko doon kasi yung, yung video na to. At yung link ng video is nasa description box. And how to get the standard deviation and variance for group data. So connect, connected to. Kasi dito, we need the standard deviation. Pati na yung frequency at yung mga ibang parts pa ng formula natin. So gamitin natin tong example na to. So tayo finishing product ng previous example natin sa previous video. So meron na tayong variance standard deviation, I think group data. Okay? Um, problem lang is, if you want to find the kurtosis, you need to have this one, yung sa numerator. This one, meron tayong to the fourth power. Kasi kung mapapansin mo sa table natin, you only have dun sa square lang siya. Okay? Yung square lang. At wala yung to the fourth power. So we need to find it. So gawa ko ng Another column for that one, yung the, the difference of the midpoint and the mean, tapos to the fourth power natin siya. So, yung color coding ko na siya. So, yung naka green, yan, kailangan natin siyang, kunin natin yung, yan yung value, tapos going to the fourth power. Okay. So, una yung negative 19, to the fourth power, that will be 130,321. Next naman, we have negative 10. To the fourth power yan, negative, yung buong negative 10, okay? That's just 10. That will be 10,000. So not ay negative 1, that will be 1. At ang 8 naman will be 4,096. At ang 17, that will be 83,521. Ngayon, kailan natin siyang i-multiply sa frequency. That will be another column. So yung frequency natin naka-purple, or violet, kung naman kulay yan, multiply natin siya dun sa naka-blue. So, 6 times mo ng 130,321, that will be 781,926. At 22 times mo ng 10,000, that will be 220,000. At ang 43 times mo ng 1, that will be 43. 20 times 1 ng 4,096, that is 114,688. And lastly, 9 times 1 ng 83,521, that will be 751,689. Okay? Now, you have to get the sum. 
pag-add mo lang lahat ng naka-gold na to, yung sa last column, you will get a sum of 1,868,346. Okay, so balikan natin yung formula. Ito na yung formula. So, alam na natin yung, yung sum, di ba? Yung sum, that will be 1,868,346. Itong buo na yun, nalagyan natin siya sa numerator. Papalit natin itong lahat na naka-red. Okay na. Ngayon, ang denominator naman, remember, an n natin will be the number of samples. So, that will be 108. At, ang standard deviation is 9.07. Kasi nahanap na natin siya before pa. Ito yung sa previous video. Ngayon, simplify natin siya. Ang denominator mo will be 730,891.49. Remember, you have to do the exponent first. 9.07 to the fourth power. And that's the time you multiply mo siya na 108. Ngayon, i-simplify na natin sa calculator. And the answer will be 2.56. Dahil ang sagot ay less than... Three, ang given distribution natin will be Lati Kertek. And that's the end of the lesson on how to find the measure of kurtosis group data. Again, this is for group data, okay? And if you would like to comment or suggest another math and language video or comment assignment kayo, please comment down below. Again, this is James, your math and language instructor. Please like and subscribe and also click the bell notification para titit kayo sa bagong videos ng Math and Language. I'll see you again. Thank you and goodbye.